Well, good Tuesday morning, church. June the 16th, 2020. Beautiful morning again, I'm telling you. I'm getting spoiled of these beautiful mornings in June when the temperature is cool and crisp outside. Wow, it is some kind of fine morning. Enjoying the outdoors, drinking coffee, just sitting around and looking at the world through... Uh, we're going through a lot of stuff, but uh, just looking at the world and thinking, praying, seeking the Lord's face, thinking about this morning, what can I do to help our world? And you know, God just threw a scripture at me that is so real this morning that I just had to share it with you this morning. Very short, very short encouraging word. 1 Corinthians sixteen fourteen. Listen to this. Let all you do be done in love. Now, I just wonder, there are families that are struggling, going through different things with their family members, couples going through things, their communities, churches. There's a nation going through things. I just wonder, I just wonder how we could change the world if we let everything we did today be done in love. I want you to consider that today. Whatever you're going to do, whoever you're going to be with, whoever you're going to spend time with, whoever you're going to talk to today, whatever you do, do it in love. Let's just see what the outcome will be. Hey, I'd love to hear from you later on after you do some acts of love today. Let everything you do be done in love. Pray for one another. Pray for our local authorities, our leadership across our county and our state. Pray for our nation, our, our federal leadership. Just pray for our nation, one nation under God. I love you guys. I pray that if you have anything in your life that's separating you from a close walk with God today, that you will pray and seek his face and turn from it. God bless you. Hope you have a wonderful day. Hey, if you have any questions or concerns, give me a shout. Don't forget, tomorrow night, second week of in-person worship on Wednesday night. We're going to have fun tomorrow night. You don't want to miss it. God bless. Have a great day.